I have to look at this job not from the perspective as a Sabahan, but uh, as a Malaysian. I was selected as the parliamentarian for Penampang in 2013, G13. And this is my second term on 2018 under Parti Warisan Sabah, of which I am a founder and also a deputy president of. You realize that you want to get into politics when you feel that you're ready to make something big and something different. And I think I realized it probably 15 years ago that I should participate in politics to to deliver a message and also whatever I can do for my community as well as uh, Sabah. I really enjoyed personally as a Sabahan, uh, of course a member of the Federation, uh, was when I wore the cigar. I thought that was something where, you know, I wanted to tell people that I am a Sabahan and I come from the ethnicity uh, of the Kadazan people and bringing it to Istana without any hassle was amazing. In the role of Warisan in this new, uh, in this new government uh, is big because we are the state government in Sabah. As a state government in Sabah, there are a lot of things that we need to correct. And we, as soon as we took over the government, we found out that things were not as painted by the previous government uh, as good as what they claimed it to be. In fact, uh, we are facing some financial challenges. At the same time, we need to do a lot of uh, restructuring of things in order to meet the, the goals and aims that we had promised the electorate. Aku sendiri memang dah kongo, dah ogumu kau makan tu kau dah nak hidup antara di Sabah menegium dah kaposisian dah itu pada kau menggunakan. Memang dah tu kau dah di Tizi ho, nampai dah pagenakan sinakagon dia ho, dah tu main om COVID dia ho, dah Sabah dah di Tawasi om lagi obuli dah menap dah tu kau masa depan di bos orang putih dah very positive and Negeri give the future untuk dos sampai kenakan om negeri warisan dan tumbuh dan tumbuh.